Don't look the same. <laughs> just seemed to you know you're getting good looks it seemed but uh what kind of that kind of changed the trajectory a little bit you're still behind the path but that seemed to get you out of that early funk would you kind of speak to those two early threes you hit uh yeah uh teammates were just looking for me uh first one rattled out and i was just trying to get us back on track and they, they found me and i got two threes and uh we ended up going to a half down one with a little bit of momentum um, Garrett, I thought, you know, you guys played pretty well defense in spurts tonight. Um, Davis had a, like a block and a steal there in the first half. And then, you know, you came in and provided some, some good minutes there in the second half defensively, which led to some offensive buckets. Can you just speak to, you know, the energy? The energy seemed a little bit different defensively tonight. Can you just speak to that? Yeah, like you said, it was, it was good in spurts, but I mean, our biggest thing the last few days is that our defense needs to get better. Obviously, we go to UAB and they score 90 something on us. Like, we don't want, we don't just want to have to outscore people. So we've right. been focusing on our defense, and we actually watched a video today about you know defense consistency. So I mean, we did it like you said in spurts, and we want to get that to be where it's more consistent. You know, we're up 15 with a minute and a half to go, and then we kind of just we lose focus at the end of the game. So we got to you know just stay locked in and. You know, finish out games and just try and do it all the time. Because when we are on on defense, it's it's scary, and that fuels our offense. So, Garrett, obviously you came off the bench tonight and were very effective. Obviously, um, you know, drawing fouls and stuff like that. Um, what kind of take me through how that kind of changes your your mindset, or does it change uh, coming off the bench versus starting? Because you've done it both. It seems like you they can plug you in wherever and mm -hmm. you know be effective. Yeah, I mean, obviously it's not hard to tell that I've struggled so far at the beginning of the season. So, and Cooper's been very productive. So, I mean, he earned that starting spot over me for the game. And, I mean, Richie made it very clear in film. Like, if I'm, I'm a fifth-year guy, I'm one of the oldest guys on the team. If I'm playing like this, like, I don't deserve to start. I don't just get free handouts because I'm a senior. I don't just start for that. I have to be productive and be out there and be a voice on defense and run the offense. So, I mean, my biggest focus was just – not trying to get points, like they'll come to me and just focus on the defensive end and being the guy who communicates on defense when the other guys don't want to, and just being able to you know lift my team up in those moments where we're down or the other team's up or something like that. Just trying to focus on getting my team together, and um, I've just been getting in the gym with Coach Johnson a lot more to change my mindset to be more aggressive. Like I've been pretty passive and just trying to you know get other guys shots, but lift my own shot as well, and just go out there and just play aggressive in all forms of my game. Um, TJ, you seemed a little bit more offensively aggressive tonight. Is that just because, you know, you're, you're feeling pretty confident your shot was going down, or is that just because you guys, at some points during the game, you need somebody to step up and, and make a shot, and you were that guy? Uh, so we, we haven't had, like, a – we've been putting a lot of pressure recently on, like, JP and Marcus to score a lot. So I just felt like I needed to be more aggressive and try to get my teammates involved or, and look for my shot more just to take a little bit of pressure off of them so they don't have to stress about scoring and playing defense. So just trying to lighten up the load for them. PJ, there's, you know, wanting to and actually doing it. And when you go out there and do it like you did tonight, does that increase your confidence even more that, you know, you're kind of finding your, your way here on this new team as you get closer to the conference play coming up? Uh, I would say so, but that's not like the most important thing for me. Like obviously I want to score points and uh, have a lot of uh, good stats, but I, I'm just trying to do whatever it takes to get my team to the best and we want to win. So if I got to step up or G has to step up, whoever it has to be, we're just going to do that, continue to do that. And you earn the right to make those shots. In practice yesterday, we did a drill where it was a defensive drill. Whoever gets the most like points, it was like points off deflections, off rebounds, off steals, and you know PJ won the day in that. So yesterday was all defensive focus. We didn't focus on offense at all. So I mean, you earn the right to hit shots by playing defense, like coaches asked us to, and coaches really emphasized. One more thing for you, Garrett. Yeah, y'all came off a really, uh, you know, kind of a tough stretch of 
teams if you're if you're talking about like tiers of basketball just on the on the different levels um what, what do you think the schedule that y'all played so far um i think it definitely helped last year can it always help yeah i mean it's important to go out there and like coach richie says we want to have a hard schedule right we don't want to play easy teams and just be undefeated or be six and one and then feel good about ourselves we want to play the hard teams out you know smack us in the mouth and expose what we need to get fixed like if we're just playing smaller teams that we know we're going to beat every time we're not going to once you get to conference play when it gets real you're not going to know what you need to fix it's going to be too late so playing those bigger teams kind of exposes the faults in your defenses and your offenses and it just gives you time to you know get everything sorted out before conference play happens and things get real